so here's my old yard works electric mower and it gave out on me last year and my husband did a little simple repair and got it working again and we just purchased another one just in case because she's been through a bit of abuse and uh, and needs some fixing again so we're going to show you now a simple fix that may help you get your mower back into working condition again if it stops working. So generally with a lot of uh, electric items like uh, lawnmowers and that sort of stuff, when they won't work, what I find is that the points are gone. Um, that's a, basically what these things are here. Um, your electricity comes in through and goes there and there and it's transferred in through here and going to your motor. And what happens is that the little graphite bar in here, it sticks inside this leaf. So I'll take out this bar, take out this little uh, uh, contraption here, and show you uh, what I do to make it work. Just to let you know, first of all, we took the cover off, which is very simple. It's just four screws and the plastic cover lifts off. And now we'll show you how to clean this little contraption. Okay, so if you're, you're going at anything like this, obviously safety first and make sure you do not have your mower plugged in. It should be unplugged. And now we'll get to fixing this little part here on the electric mower. So what I'll do is just slide that off, a little contraption there, and sometimes you might need like a little punch or something just to loosen, loosen it up, just to have it come out like that. You can see it's rusty, so it's it's sort of stuck inside the plastic sleeve. You pull it out, and this here, it sticks. It I can feel resistance in there. That should slide back and forth very easily. So what I need to do is just take this little plate off here by bending back these two little tabs, taking this out, and that'll allow me to remove this. You want to be careful if you're using a knife. There we go. Slide it underneath there. Grab the tab with a pair of pliers. Straighten it out. And this should wiggle off and that comes out. that comes out as you can see probably inside there you can see rust and corrosion so I'm just going to use this piece of sandpaper just to sand all four sides and you can also give this piece of graphite or carbon, just a little quick, just once over with the, the sandpaper. And uh, I'm thinking maybe if you had some dot at your grease or something like that, you could put it on that if need be, but most of the time you don't. So you just slide that back inside, push it through. And there, it, it slides very easily back and forth. So I will slide this back plate over the tabs. There we go. Then I'll bend them back over. One. And the other. And just a quick little tap with the hammer. We'll flatten them out like that. So we're getting to the final step. We just slide that. You can just see it slides very easily back and forth. You put that in there. Give it a little tap. Put the terminal back on. Now we'll just plug it in and see if it works. He had already done it with this side, so you'll need to do it with both sides. Uh, so we just showed you one side and you can do it the same thing on the other side as well Okay, so now we just plugged the machine in so got the top off so don't go anywhere near down there and uh, We're gonna just give her a go There we go back into working condition probably for another season saved ourselves another hundred and twenty dollars uh, That's two years in a row now just for a simple little fix. Uh, so if your electric mower breaks down, you can 
give this a try first and you may save yourself a few dollars and save sending something to the trash.